Hi Capricorn, this is Power and Light Tarot coming at you with your reading, your love reading, and this is going to be your love reading trick or truth, okay? We're trying to get to the bottom of whether or not whoever you're dealing with is honest, all right? <laughs> I feel like it's an important thing, okay? Uh, not that everybody is a liar. <laughs> Uh, anyway, um, before we get going here, Capricorn, I would like to thank everybody for all their likes, shares, and subscribes. I feel like you guys rock, okay? Thank you so much, you guys. Don't forget to hit the like button on the way out, okay, guys? Um, and don't forget the bell button if you guys want notifications of these readings, okay? So now I have um, two love readings going out a month, um, and they are a little bit different. This spread talks about, you know, what they want, also what you want, um, and the past and current dynamic here, okay? And so there's, you know, there's some different placements here. Um, you know, so this is a different spread, guys, okay? So let's get going, Capricorn. The bottom of the deck is the King of Cups and the Page of Pentacles. I feel like this totally ties in with your reading and that the King of Cups is here again in your reading. And also the Page of Pentacles, you know, I feel like that totally ties in here. Somebody wanted to, you know, have a new start. They, they really saw the value or the worth in this situation or in this in this relationship. I feel like you're dealing with somebody who, um, it, I don't think you guys have been together a really long time, um, but, you know, somebody was, you know, kind of really, really wanting this. So let's get going here. Um, yeah, and this definitely is about love when the King of Cups shows up twice, okay? Your current energy, Capricorn, is, uh, they're all reversals here, and I've been, you know, not dealing with so many reversals lately, so it's kind of interesting that that came out here. The Six of Wands in the reverse, the Nine of Wands in the reverse, and the Ten of Wands all in the reverse. I feel like what's going on here is that, um, you know, you couldn't find victory or something. You gave up and you dropped the burden, okay? It's that simple, okay? <laughs> and, you know, your wants and desires, interestingly, is the Justice card and the Four of Wands in the reverse, all right? I feel like what's going on here is, you know, uh, you didn't want this. This is your desire, okay? These are your wants and your desires, but you really didn't want this relationship. And that's why the Four of Wands is in the reverse here, all right? You're like, oh, I'm not really into it, okay? The Justice card is in the reverse, too. You know, I feel like you, maybe you thought that they weren't up to your, your scales, so to speak, or something like that, you know, whoever you're dealing with. Um... You could have also felt that there wasn't any balance here, so you didn't want it, right, with the Justice card, or the, maybe there was something unfair here. But clearly with the Four of Wands in the reverse, you just didn't want this union, all right? Now, how you are seeing them or how you feel about them is the Ten of Swords in the reverse with the Magician in the reverse, okay? The Magician in the reverse, guys, is, you know... It's it's a couple things, but, you know, mostly it is either a trickster or somebody who just can't, you know, make things work, can't manifest the situation, they feel powerless. I feel like you're seeing them as letting it go, and uh, they have no power here. They weren't able to manifest the situation here, this union, so they are, you know, letting it go. You could also be seeing them. You could be letting them go. And kind of, you know, seeing them as unable to manifest the situation, all right? Don't laugh too much at the other person, all right, Capricorn? <laughs> uh, I just, yeah, I have a Capricorn friend who is living this situation. Okay, their, your, their current energy right now, Capricorn, is the devil card. They could be seriously feeling you here, okay, since you do rule the devil, all right? Um, the Six of Wands is here again, all right, in their energy with the Hermit. So you could be with, this person that you were dealing with, Capricorn, could have been a hermit, all right? Because the hermit is here, also over here, all right? It's coming up twice, you know, I do always have two decks here for that purpose, okay? So this means that, you know, some of you guys are definitely dealing with a hermit or a Virgo, okay? Now, the, since, the, since the devil is in their current energy with the six of uh, wands here, you know, they could be trying to overcome you or overcome maybe why this didn't work out, but, um, you know, overcome the situation, right, with the hermit. I feel like they could have, you know, totally gone soul-searching if they're not um, if they're not a Virgo, if they're not the hermit. 
But in any event, um, I feel like they wanted victory with you. They wanted success with you. And um, the other thing, I feel like this is, you know, with, with the devil showing up in their current energy, I just feel like they are feeling, you know, maybe stuck about the situation. They could have fear. They could have, you know, um, insecurities, right? Because, um, yeah, because you don't, I feel like you're not really, you know, feeling this relationship, right? Okay. So um, this, is an, this is an interesting reading. Okay, guys. Now, what they want here, they wanted the Three of Pentacles. Um, the Tower is with it, the Star and the Queen of Cups. No, they don't want the Tower, but, you know, these cards together is pointing out the fact that they wanted to work it out with you with the Three of Pentacles. Um, they did. And um, they wanted to work on this, and there was a tower moment, and you are their star, okay? They had a lot of hopes for this. I feel like that's what this is, all right? But the tower fell, and it is about love because the Queen of Cups is here. So, you know, yes, there could be a water sign involved, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I feel like for a lot of you guys, just a Virgo. It's a hermit, right? But, um, yeah, they, uh, there is love here because the King of Cups is here twice. Whoever you're dealing with is in love with you, okay? Capricorn. All right. <laughs> um, now, how they are viewing you, Capricorn, or how they feel about you is the King of Cups and Temperance. So I feel like they're really in love with you and they think that you are their angel. Wow. I mean, these are some nice cards, okay? <laughs> they are. All right. Okay, guys. Um, now, the next, uh, next up is the past dynamic of the situation here, alright, Capricorn? I feel like the past dynamic is that somebody could have been waiting here to figure out if they wanted to really hold on to the situation, alright, with these cards. I feel like that's what this is. You could have been waiting to, you know, kind of trying to figure it out because the Seven of Pentacles is in the reverse. In the upright, you are thinking about it. You're waiting and you're trying to make a decision. When the Seven of uh, Pentacles in the reverse, you've already made your decision. The waiting is over. And many times, it's not something that you, you know, thought was anything really great. Like, you, you thought it wasn't worth your investment. It wasn't worth the harvest, or it didn't reap a lot, okay? Now, here are the cards we have here. I feel like this is you. Now, this is the past dynamic here. Um, could have also been trying to figure out if you just wanted to cut the situation out here with these cards, okay? And the past, the current dynamic, uh, Capricorn, I'm going over to Vimeo right now, guys, and I'm going to be uh, talking about the current dynamic. What is challenging this union? Um, and also here, um, what, it, what they're hiding. Not really what they're hiding, but what they may not want you to know here. Um, it's a little bit different here. But also, um, you know, whether or not they're being honest with you, okay? Uh, because I feel like that is super important here, um, especially these days, okay, with so much dishonesty, okay? <laughs> so the link is below, you guys, and thank you so much. And these videos are only $8.99 to see all the extendeds, okay, guys? If you need a private reading, they're $22, and, you know, that is serious value here. And you can just, you can check the About section for all the info, okay, guys? Thank you so much.